Here we'll do a couple from 114E. For these kinds of problems, you're given a name and you're asked to draw the structure. So I like to work backwards. The chain is a heptane, and the branch off the chain is a methyl group, and it's at carbon number 4. So I'm going to draw 7 carbons. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And I'm going to, the methyl group is off carbon number 4. Well, because there's only one group off the chain, the main chain, you could count 1, 2, 3, 4 here, or 1, 2, 3, 4 here. It's basically right in the middle. So we'll connect the carbons. Oops. After connecting the carbons, let's see 1, 2, 3, 4, and there's the methyl group. And the rest of the chain is 5, 6, 7. Here we're asked to draw ethyl cyclopropane. Again, working from the end of the name propane. This is a cyclopropane. So propane means three carbons, and cyclo means in a ring. So we're going to put three carbons together in a ring structure. And then I have to account for that ethyl group. And it doesn't tell me any specific carbon. And that's because there's only one um, branch off this ring. So you could put that branch on any one of these three carbons. And the branch is an ethyl group. And ethyl means two carbons. And I'll just put them right up here. So get the bond tool and connect the ethyl group to that top carbon as we're looking at it. Another one, we're asked to draw cyclopentane. This is a ring structure, cyclo, with five pentane, five carbons. So we'll just lay out five carbons, two, three, four, five, and connect those carbons in a ring structure. and there's cyclopentane.